Welcome back to the Hockey Shop Source for Sports. New gear rollout continues. This week we've got the new Bauer, and I made this mistake on the podcast cam. I was going to call it the Hyperlite. There is no more vapor supreme separation. Bauer's going with the Pro, Elite, and GSX. Three models, one sort of skate principle. Can you walk me through what we're talking about here? How much of this is the vapor line? How much of this is the Supreme? You can see the call out on the skates cam. Looks like they're blending the best of both worlds. Yeah, that's correct. I mean, without really kind of stealing the thunder, which you kind of did there a little bit, we'll wind back a bit. What's happened? So, Bauer um, reassessed their player line a couple years back um, and decided that the player market was getting a little bit cloudy um, in terms of there was a lot of skates on the wall and a lot of people were buying skates not necessarily based off fit, but we're more buying them based off of new release, for example. That same thing kind of translated down here uh, into the goalie side of things. New Supreme Skate would come out, general population buys a new Supreme Skate. New Vapor Skate comes out, general population buys a new uh, Vapor Skate. When in reality, they were very different products. Correct. I, the nice thing was they, in the Gold Skate side of things, the fit were still very close, but however, there were some major differences, um, but not as much as what you would find up at stairs in the player department. That said, um, rather than having that cloudiness, Bauer's gone with one line of skates, but three different fits within that in the pro and uh, elite level category. So uh, with the pro skate that Kevin's holding, so brand new for uh, this season here. So still following with the same uh, lower profile toe cap that we found in the uh, ultrasonic skates uh, when they released. What's changed though is now A, their integration of Stance Flex technology. Uh, what does that mean? you're basically getting the flexibility of a vapor skate up top. So that's called out through all the red here in my nice little demo skate, which you can check out if you're local to us at uh, beautiful Wally BC here. Um, gives you flex up top, especially at the laces when you tied up so you get a little bit more forward in your stance. However, when you go to go push, that bottom outsole, all supreme, that's giving you that power and that stability as you push off. So that's more of a stiffer part of the skate, more of a softer part of the skate. It's a nice combination of both worlds in terms of that uh, style of play. So the stiff boot in the bottom sort of create that tight fit where there's not going to be a lot of wiggle room for the foot as you push. All of that energy transfers into the ice. No lost energy or very little lost energy. But at the top, you've got that flex and that ability to sort of flex forward, as they call it, the Stance Flex Pro, um, and sort of get on your toes a little bit more as a goaltender. What are some of the other changes? That's correct. and. Even within that too, so Bowers played off this even a little bit more, uh, new style of steel. It still is their LS5G, however, um, they call it Agility Profile. So what that means is, is this is already coming stock with a, a goalie profile on it. I believe it's the goalie SAM profile off the top of my head. Um, is the exact specifications, I believe it was 10 foot, 50, 28. Um, so three different radiuses along the correct. blade of the skate. So, so as uh, a little more profile of the toe and the heel and a little flatter in the middle. That's correct. So again, allowing you to get onto that toes, but as soon as you're swinging off that post, you have that little bit of a flat portion to help catch that edge properly, push off, for example. So uh, nice added feature, a nice combo with that stance flex. Not the only features, we still got a couple more to cover here. So as I alluded to a little bit earlier on there, uh, three distinctly different fits in this now. So you have a fit one, which is something we haven't really seen in goal skates before. It's more of like a C width as comparing it to like a player width upstairs. So if you get them skinny feet. Long, narrow feet. Fit two, more of your stock vapor fit, more of your stock D width skate. Um, familiar for those guys coming out of vapor uh, and whatnot, it'll still feel a lot of that same. Fit three, it'll be their deepest and widest fit. So more like that double E fit in a Supreme, for example. Um, Again, if you're needing more volume inside that skate, uh, we're needing your foot to set a little bit deeper in, that's where that fit three skate comes into play. So three fits, one skate, a uh, combination of Supreme on the bottom, Vapor up top in terms of the flex. Nice looking liner in there, the Pro Comfort liner on the Pro Skate. Almost a little bit reminiscent of what was in the old uh, reactor skates, like the 9000. It's not that same like pour on pad, but it has that same soft gel feel, especially in the ankle pad. So it's gonna be nice and comfortable there. That same style of foam is actually on the tongue as well. Um, again, giving lots of comfort, not too worried about lace bite with that skate or anything like that. 
that about covers it for the pro skate. I actually, you know what I was just going to call out? I mean, I like that they've carried over the Lundquist loop, the new version of it that we saw in the ultrasonic skate last year, as opposed to the Vapor 2X Pro Skate, where it was more of a traditional sort of loop that hung off the back. This one's anchored at the top and the bottom. It just creates a bit of a wider space to get. We saw with some of the old, their original Lundquist loops, you could get a, you know, you get a bootstrap that was a little too thick and hard to get through there. This one's much easier. So that'll carry through on the new Bauer Pro line. It will also carry down to, let's go through the different lines because same principle, Supreme, Vapor combination carries through to the Bauer Elite. So this is your second price point skate now. Um, again, we see same principles. You, we didn't mention curve composite, which obviously is what helps form that stability, that rigidity down at the bottom of the skate, really help you lock in. What are the difference now, Cam? What are you getting? What are you not getting? Because obviously you're getting it for less money. The Bowery Elite Skate dropping down from the Pro. I'm glad you caught that cue there. Uh, I definitely uh, switched that around for a reason because we did uh, fr quickly forget to mention that Curvex Composite still makes its return back to the boots. However, this is something that actually gets brought down to this Elite Skate. So you're still getting Curve Composite in the Elite Skate. Correct. Wow. Which is a great upgrade. Now, this really is almost a Pro Skate. It, it gets so close to it. So there are some features that do uh, um, take away from being the Pro to the Elite. That said, Still featuring that Stan Select te technology. So again, still a little bit more flexible at the lace package, but stiffer down low to give you those harder pushes. Still curved composite, which is fantastic in terms of like overall rigidity for the boot and also its longevity. Where things start to differ a little bit, just more of your standard felt tongue, nothing too fancy here. More of your standard liner, just a felt liner. Still has got some comfort to it, especially in the ankle paddings, but it's definitely not as thick as that Pro Skate. You gotta have a bit of a difference somewhere. Steel. Stock LS 3G Plus, so still taller, taller steel and still a pro quality stainless steel, just not your black edge coated. Stock profile here, so nothing exciting there. Um, always something you can get done aftermarket. That said, you still have an, well, we'll even call it an elite level skate for really what it is and probably why they came up with the name Elite. Great idea, great price point as well. Price point, give me a ballpark what we're looking at from the Elite, and we'll get into the GS next. From the Pro to the Elite, what are we looking at? So now you're gonna put me on the spot again. Uh, or you could just, you know, you could- Oh, uh, hey. Oh, yeah. It's on the wall up. already, folks. We're helping them out here. 570 so for the on, senior you're, skate. You're, 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 you're quick math there. I'm not really good at the whole math thing, but you're like $370 cheaper from the pro down to the elite, and you're getting a lot of good quality. Exactly, so if you're still you know, looking for a performance value skate, but looking to save a little bit of money in terms of your gear package, or you know, for example, on skates, another great option. Especially if you've got a kid that's still growing, you worry you're not even gonna get through one full season in the same size, because those feet are just taken off, which is a good thing if you're goalie, because usually the you know, bigger feet, taller goalie. Uh, last one, and, and also I like that, you know, again, the loop continues, small little details, finishing details that, uh, make the difference. The Bauer GSX, this is your lower price point skate. I look over my shoulder. We're down to 269 on this one. Um, what you get, what you don't get, because obviously as the price drops, you're, you're not gonna get the same type of materials. What is the big difference? I'm, I'm assuming we're losing curve composite on this one. We are, however, they're still actually using a composite boot. So it's not as high grade as curve, but it's very, very close. So it's still giving us a nice stiff construction, which is great to have at that lower price point. Again, for longevity and also performance value out of the skate itself. Stance Flux still exists here. Uh, so again, you're still getting that little forward flex up front, stiffer outsole, again, to get that better push off. That said, some of the things and features of this skate, so we're not featuring that fit one, two, and three system here. This is back to your standard D and double E width skate. Its fit profile is very, very close to the X2.7 skate. So if you have that skate, you're gonna be very, very familiar with the style of skate in terms of fitness wise. We never asked, and, and I'm sorry to pull you out, but the Elite, does, it, does the Elite still have the three fits? That's correct. Okay, so you get the three fit system in Pro and Elite, just not in GSX. That's correct, yes. So uh, a couple other features of the skate. So again, standard felt tongue, um, nothing too exciting here. Not the thickest, it's a little bit thinner, but again, we need to make some of those switches as we're kind of tearing down to the price point. Standard felt liner, not as much of that uh, soft ankle padding as you'd find in that Elite Skate. Again, we gotta make a step down somewhere. That said, still comfortable, great for that goalie, rec goalie, one, two, three times a week, 
kid that's growing that needs to you know cycle through pairs of skates in less than a season they're definitely out there um steel ls 1g plus so uh, a little bit of a lower quality stainless steel that said still excellent in terms of for that extra height because you don't need that it helps the, lo the longevity of the skate for sure always replaceable as with all of these these are all the same holder so we can snap them in and out very easily other than that your great price point skate that is the new Bauer Pro Elite and GSX. No more back and forth between Supreme and Vapor. No more Hyperlight, Ultrasonic for the skates. It's gonna be one skate moving forward but with so many options, you can understand why they're gonna simplify and yet at the same time give you more options than they did before. I like the move for Bauer. The good news, as you can see behind me, there's a lot of sale tags. When we get something new, that means stuff that's a couple of years old or a year and a half old, is all on sale. I'm seeing a lot of discounted Bauer skates behind me over my left shoulder. If you wanna find out, if you're looking for deals instead of the latest, you can check them out at thehockeyshop.com, check out what's on sale, what they've got left in terms of sizing and stock. And if you have any questions about either, call Cam. 604-589-8299. And 1-800-567-7790. It's actually got it down pat, folks. <laughs> Thanks, Cam. <laughs> Thank you.